It is not a blockbuster for BMW, the 2004 North American International Auto Show, unveiling the convertible version of its new-to-market 6 Series. The coupe came out in Frankfurt. But nonetheless, few automotive watchers are not at the BMW event. The attraction? Not the cars as much as the man behind their design, 47-year-old Chris Bangle, born in Ohio. When I think, what is a 6? And that, it's a magic number in BMW. Then I say, okay, we, I think we hit it right on with this car. It's got just enough relationship from the 7 Series to put it up at the top end of our whole product lineup. He's a sculptor. He's a, a theologist. And um, uh, he has really turned the car design world on its head. Bangle has been the head of design at BMW since 1992, coming over from Fiat before that Opel. Each step, each place he's been, he's created a stir, suggested, pushed, polished designs that have been different, unexpected. This is a man, after all, that creates multimedia works of art, carpet, furniture, shoes. The best way to understand your customers is to be involved in their, their complete lives, and their lives are a lot more than just cars and motorcycles. Their lives are their computers and their, their trains and, and things, you know, that they interact with every day. This is DesignWorks USA. Following Bengals' philosophy, about 30% of the work done at BMW's DesignWorks USA in Newberry Park, California, is non-automotive stuff for outside clients. Bangle, a frequent visitor from his main office in Germany. Under his tutelage, BMW has reworked the Mini and Rolls-Royce brands. He's introduced new product, raised a few eyebrows with the Z4 as an example, but it's been his work on the signature BMW series that has boiled some Bavarian blood. First, remember what BMW is. Since the founding of BMW in 1929, a staid conservative German car company at the upper price range, serving a staid conservative tradition-bound clientele. So when Bengel unveiled his redo of the 7 Series a couple of years ago, whoa, Nelly, hold the Brockwurst. What's with that back end? A lot of folks hated it. You can't change a very uh, stable, inertia-driven driven mark like BMW to adapt to a new set of circumstances as we did without creating a lot of controversy. There had not been a rhythm of change for so long that anything we did was going to ignite a lot of fires. Chris Bangle isn't backing out of his wildness and creativity anytime soon. He's caused controversy at every car company where he's served. We've got a one series coming out? How about that? That's kind of a shocking idea. You know, what's a one series? Bangles is a design voice listened to in studios around the world, and where he wants cars to go is back to being icons and less of a commodity. We have begun to, to perceive whole vehicle categories in only in terms of how cheap can they be, uh, how quick can I get rid of them, get another one, etc. And, and not really taking the time to say, gosh, you know, men and women really carved this surface. And, and when it looks like this in the light, I can appreciate that the people who created this really took the time.